David Lynch's new show, Twin Peaks, here now. Take a look at this man acting here in the show. Watch this. When you least expect it. Ladies and gentlemen, here's Dana Ashbrook. Dana. Thank you for being here. Hey. So, hey, explain the barking. What? What is it? What are you doing there? And you, you have just been incarcerated. You were the first suspect interviewed. Is that correct? Yes, that yeah. is correct. Um, the barking thing happened with, uh, we were on location up there in Seattle. Mm -hmm. And David and I... David were, Lynch, David the Lynch. creator, producer, director of some of the episodes. Yes. Yeah. Uh, we're talking about... Uh, he wanted a primal scream, yeah. like a football thing, to yeah. go along with the whole football theme. And um, and so we went out on this 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 roof, and it was snowing, and and we were we were going over different types of barks, you know, <laughs> which uh, was fun. Show and then, business is nuts, isn't it? <laughs> it's wacky. Yeah. <laughs> and uh, and so we worked on it, and he we just had gotten it to the right pitch that he wanted, yeah. the more intense bark. And then some man came out and said, hey, uh, you guys can't be on the roof. you got to get off the roof. It's going to break the, the roof. Yeah, well, but no. David's like, oh, okay, well, come on. Uh, what kind of guy is uh, David Lynch? He's, he has, a, I believe, his background. Is, was he an art student initially? A long yeah, time ago? I think so. Yeah. You know, I'm not sure how exactly he started. I know that he started off painting and, and filming mm -hmm. his paintings. Mm -hmm. what, what kind of a guy is he just to hang around with? Well, he's very nice. I'm sure you've heard a lot of things like the kid from Mars and all that, but he's very polite and very nice and very artistic, yeah. and he's a genius, and he's wacky. I yeah. mean, he's... Dur directed uh, uh, Blue Velvet. Yeah. Uh, and uh, uh, Eraser Elephant Head. Man. Oh. Eraserhead. Elephant yeah. Man. Yeah. And what else? What am I not... Dune. <coughs> yeah. Dune. Thank you. And... <laughs> <laughs> all right. So, so now let, let's talk about the, the Twin Peaks thing here. Well, this is a great, a great uh, thing for you to be in as a young actor, isn't it? I'm very lucky. Because it, it came to television and just uh, knocked people's... Uh, whatever people get knocked off when they see oh, something like that. everything. It. Yeah. Uh, and, and how long will this go on now? Well, it goes through, I think, May 24th is the last episode. Right. And then uh, we're up to the... Uh, we're up to eight, whatever ABC says. So. Oh, so it may come back again uh, in the fall yeah. as a, a, a new if series. Yeah, people watch. And with the same characters and stuff, the same story? Yeah. yeah. I mean, a further progression of it. So the deal now is uh, people are interested in knowing who uh, killed uh, Laura Palmer, right? right. Yeah. Ha and have we found out? Do we know any more than we did in the, in the, the first film? Um, well, you, you found out that she, you know, they found some strange markings on her shoulder mm -hmm. and there's been clues as to what exactly happened and how she got killed. Yeah. And, um, you know, you'll find out more as the weeks Now, do you on. know who did it? Does anybody know who did it? No one knows, but I have my own ideas. Now, that can't be true. Someone must know. Well, I'm sure David and Mark have an idea. They David, know. David Lynch and Mark Frost, the right, creators. Right. But as far as us actors, we're, you know. You're lying. You know. We're slept. Well, I'm lying, David. <laughs> I'm, I know a little bit. I don't know now, what. All right, plan. tell us what you know about it. Oh. Because I know who did it. I'll be killed. No, no, no. Just, just give us a hint. And all I want to know, I want to see if what you know fits with what I know. <laughs> That's all we do, because I do. <laughs> you are... No, I, uh, just tell me what you know. Um, what I know is that it has to deal with more than one person. Yeah, it was the FBI guy, right? Well, you know, It was. It was. It's the FBI guy. It's either the FBI guy or the log lady. I don't know, you know. Ooh. I, everything I own says it was the FBI guy. Why do you think that, though? What, what? Well, why else? Who else would have done it? I mean, isn't, isn't if the thing is just nuts to begin with, is, doesn't he make the logical uh, choice? Isn't he the one? That, I mean, he's just as goofy as they come. <laughs> he is goofy. All right, uh, speaking, of, speaking of goofy, you know, now, tell me about this other film. You, you uh, did a movie with uh, Bill Cosby. That must have been a really exciting experience. It was. It was great. It was so much fun, you know, I, and Sidney Poitier directed it, and, and so... What's, I, what's the name of the film? Ghost Dad. Ghost Dad. So you already, you're a very young man. You've been in some really high-profile, important projects here, I would think. Well, yeah, well, I'm starting. Yeah. So Ghost Dad, what, tell me about okay, Ghost well, Dad. Okay, well, this thing, this thing, Cosby and I were, he was doing this scene where he had to choke me, and we're in front of a blue screen. Is Cosby a nice guy? Yeah, he's, yeah. Yeah, he's yeah. a great guy, very funny. Did you call him Bill? I called him, actually, well, everyone kind of called him Mr. Cosby. Everyone was like that, but on the last day of work, I was, like, saying goodbye, and he said, oh, okay, this won't be another Leonard Part Six. 
<laughs> See you later. And I said, okay, bye, Bill. Yeah. And that was my big, you know, yeah. kind yeah. of step yeah. towards that. But and he had guys you. knock you down. Yeah. <laughs> Actually, I still have a bullet in my shoulder, but... Um, <laughs> No, this is the thing. Uh, he's choking me, and he's a ghost, and we're doing it in front of this blue screen. And he's right. choking me, and he doesn't want to hurt me, so he keeps saying, is that right? You know, I don't mm -hmm. want to choke him. And I started to choke. I started to gag. You're actually and about I'm, to, you're getting uh, sleepy. I'm like going like yeah. this. And, I, and so I, I say, hold on, Bill, Mr. Cosby, please, you know, yeah. give me a break here. And so everyone laughs. And then we're doing it again, and he's choking me, and I'm like flustered and all kind of hung up. And, and I started saying his line when he's choked me. Yeah. I'm supposed to say a line, and I started saying his line. Yeah. And I laughed, and I went, <coughs> And this piece of spit from the back of my throat went and just hit him Boom. right on the cheek. Yeah. Just kind of hung right on his cheek. And I went, oh, man, I'm sorry. Yeah. And wiped it yeah. off. And he goes, uh, well, God, I saw it. It came from the back of your throat. It had Ooh. wings on it. Yeah. <laughs> it was disgusting. Blew out. All right. Let's go back to the guy. What? You know? Hello. Where did he? We'll uh, be right back here. Uh, Dana, nice to meet you. Congratulations nice you. on your success, and we'll look for Ghost Dad coming Ghost Dad. soon. Okay, there you go. Uh, my thanks also to Patty Austin and... Uh, yes, Martin folks, Short the rumors and, uh, are true. Howard's back on 